The Bands of America Grand National Championships are, of course, about excellence. Uh, one of the things that drives that excellence is competition. These are judged events, and they're judged by an expert panel of adjudicators. There are seven judges judging each performance, two of them down on the field, five up in the press box. That's almost 150 performances spread out over three days. How do they keep track of it all? How do they judge the bands? The judges that are here get to see some of these bands, a good number of them, over the course of the season, so they're somewhat familiar. And so that kind of gives them a mindset and a paradigm about where the numbers might be. They judge the show as it comes to them and not any kind of preconception is, is just really pretty cool to watch. Once the judge gives a number, that's really just the start of the process. That number goes into a scoring system that's uh, run by tabulation. So it's all sent electronically, uh, either over Wi-Fi um, or a 4G network. Uh, all the numbers are sent right up from the judges. Once those scores are verified, it's tabulation as usual up here in the box. It's just we get that information that much faster and in real time now. You, you check, <laughs> you double check, you triple check. We do, we triple check. There are so many facets to BOA Grand Nationals. Some of them are visible that you see out on the field. Others behind the scenes just as crucial to making sure that this Grand Nationals competition runs as smoothly and as accurately as possible.